look at that. It's lifting up right now. Look, you can see the water coming off. That's awesome. <laughs> so this thing has airbags. This is incredible. This has got to be my favorite off-road camper trailer I've seen here at Overland Expo East. So we're going to show you it. Let's check it out. It's the Pause by Palomino. Hey, my name's Phil. And I've been living in a 4x4 truck camper for the last five years while making videos of other quality off-road campers that I think are down to mob. You just lifted it all up. It's auto leveling. Look at that. It's going quick. And it's all on your phone and it's telling you a little step by step what it's doing. Do I need to turn it? There you go. You're good. I can see that. That's insane, man. That is and then you really see your neat. pitch and your roll just like your little Jeep has on its dashboard. Yep, little inclinometer. Yep, yep, yep. Auto leveling is nuts. But like, so that's just part of what's going on in the suspension system is the airbags. You can see that one mainly compressed. But look at this. You got dual Bilstein struts on independent arms. This is no joke. Aluminum. This is, yeah. This thing will take a beating. But look at this. This whole hatch opens up. You do have a window, even when it's closed. But when it's open, you've got this all open. But you've also got the screen. It's just the best of all the worlds. Look at this. Full bed here. Got yourself a uh, TV right there. This TV actually flips out to the outside in that window. So you can see it outside. He's still messing with the air. And I'm literally feeling this trailer go down. Like... Crazy. So yeah, this, little... what is it? Oh, it's Velcro. So this is Velcro, right? Or you have the zipper here. You can do that, whatever you want to do. Mm -hmm. And then this all rolls up. Look at that. So this is all going to roll up. Yeah. You know, so you can get the outdoor. So if you're, you know, I'm from South Carolina, we have bugs. But if you go somewhere where there's no bugs, you know, you can do that. But here's what's cool also, under the bed, Oh wow, you got a bunch you of storage. You have access to your Battleborn batteries down here. Look at that. And this has 570 amp hours right now, upgradable to 1,080. Whew. And if you have bikes, you have adjustable tie downs right here. Beautiful, yeah, L-Track, this is all nice composite paneling. You saw that aluminum frame underneath. Strong and, components and then on make this a side, strong it's all trailer. Yeah. Oh, you didn't see this thing, did you? No. It's closed. Okay. Look at that. Oh, beautiful. Thanks. Wow, that's nicely done. I like that it's covered. A lot of people wouldn't maybe go that step to cover it, but then you can actually store things in here and not worry Correct. about it. And that's the whole point about it. You can use it as storage. It's covered, but like many things, you can take these off when you have to service it. Yeah. Here's all your Garmin control. So all that stuff that I was showing you on the phone, that's all right here. Rad. You can just do you know all that. You have a real ladder to get up to your solar. Mm -hmm. um, you have lights on the Garmin system. You can turn. You have a bump in the night. You just hit all exterior lights on, and it lights up 360 degrees. I kind of want to climb this ladder. Climb it up there, man. <laughs> right? Whoa! Here, yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Oh wow! Oh wow! Cool. How many okay, solar here, panels? I'll show you. How many solar panels you got up there? Wow. Okay. Let's count the panels. We got one. Two, three, four, five, six. Are those 100 watts? We got 600 watts? Correct. Holy cow, I, I nailed it. On the other pauses, those have uh, 600 and 800 watts on the other ones. Awesome. And that is that a Truma AC there and Max fan? And... Nice. Yeah, the Max fans are great. And the windows have a, it has a two stage, two stages on the windows. So you can do a little crack, hit your Max air fan and, and Suck up all that good air. That's awesome. Well, I hope you're enjoying this trailer as much as I am. And if you like my content and my videos, consider joining my Patreon at patreon.com slash down to mob to get ad-free videos, exclusive content, as well as options for one-on-one -on -one guidance so I could help you build your dream vehicle or build your dream life on the road. Really anything. Let's hang out and chat at patreon.com slash down to mob. But let's check out more of this beautiful trailer. But you can hear this thing working. So what's really cool about it lifting up is you could tow it obviously really low on the road, get better fuel economy, aerodynamics, all that good stuff. But also if you're off-roading and you're just on a fire road, you're not, you don't know how gnarly it's going to get. And then it gets gnarly, 
you can lift that bad boy up and get a lot more clearance. So we'll get the ladder down, take you guys inside, show you the interior. This is really why I love this thing, is the interior. Um, it is, a, I mean, number one, I love it because of the composite two and a half inch panels. Um, no framing, no wood in this whole thing from what I've heard and what I know. Aluminum frame. What do you think up there? Right? <laughs> Chassis all aluminum, all composite material. Um, it's all CNC. Yeah. All these holes that you see are all pre drilled, so there's no variations. And these are uh, put together like aircrafts. The rivets are two sided rivets, so there's a guy on one side and a guy on another one. You're hammering them together. That's awesome, man. So, but you got an outdoor sink. You also have a connection over on the other side for, your, for another shower. Uh, outdoor fridge, cooktop. All the good stuff yeah the interior though like obviously quality components and build are number one but the layout it's got to be it's got to be comfy um and then yeah this thing big dinette over here love that windows all around hatch up here um just epic like plenty of space in this dinette but check out the fridge freezer right here Look at that. It's just right up in your face. You can see everything you got. And then here's your garbage control on the inside too. Oh, cool. You can see all your fresh water. You turn all, remember I told you you turn all your lights on? Yeah. Right here, your temperature outside. Here's your max air fan. Air out, turn that on high. And that thing nice. And the shower and bathroom is big. Like, I wonder how many people you can fit in here. Wow, this bathroom fits a lot of people for sure. <laughs> They're separate. Yeah. I, don't, I don't think I look, look at like that. the toilet in the shower. Yeah. Yeah, this shower bathroom's awesome. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny, huh? <laughs> um, you got a suburban two burner. You got oh nice. A nice, classy, homey sink with a uh, fold-away nozzle there. And that has a cover that goes on top of it. Uh -huh. So if you want to use this, you know, as a, as a whole table workspace. You can. Yeah. Here's a fun fact, a fun feature. You ready for this? Yeah. Oh, bam. Oh, you got some more plugs. Two yeah. USBs, two ACs. Does this table swivel? Microwave. Yeah, it swivels, goes down, and turns into a bed. So neat. Yeah, yeah it's 360. Yeah, we're down in the bed here. We've got overhead storage. This is all aluminum too. It's all metal. Very strong on strong struts. Like just good stuff. This is not your classic wood frame camper RV quality stuff. This is this is off-road overland approved. Yeah. I mean it does. From everything I can see. This will hold up. So you just pull that, the swivels around. Wow, you can get that table wherever you want it. Put it wherever, so. Huh. Wow, that might be the most adjustable too. table I've ever seen. Nice. <laughs> That's a big it dinette. Into, it goes down and turns into a bed. Nice. And you have this window up front, window here, and the side windows open at 90 degrees like this window. Yeah. That's how you get the TV out. So many windows. Two huge windows here, like four windows overall in this space. I love the sectioned off area. I mean, this is just, I don't know. This is like a perfect interior layout. This I like it. Be a, this is going to be a four season camper too. Yeah. So it's got the Truma heat, heater on it. It's all piped throughout. Yeah. So it just have heat all the time you have heated tanks so you guys can take this in cold areas yeah might have to yeah might have to try living out of this for a while what do you guys think oh, here's you, another, think you, you think we could live out of this so if you're over there down in the so comments so you're if you're over here you can get to the fridge this way yeah but if she needs a drink from over here she just goes <laughs> like that. no way yeah. what kind of magic is that feel, or if you feel like the hulk you just go oh i'm gonna do it for me Oh no! Well, can you really like take the whole so, thing off? There, at the show, there's been four people that've done this, and I can't get to do it. That's funny. Anyway, they That's took the weird. Whole, they took the whole doors off, and I'm like, what? How did you even do that? That would scare me so, for power same consumption. With the, same with the freezer. Yeah. 
so you can get your ice and not have to get it from work. That's so cool. And is this all, this is all aluminum? Is it's that right? It's all aluminum. Yeah. Aluminum. There's zero wood in this. It's yes. It's all composite material and aluminum. I literally told them outside there's no wood in this that I've heard of. Yeah, I don't no know that, but I've been paying attention. Yeah. No wood. No wood. No wood. Amazing. No mold. I love it. No mold. Yeah, no wood, no mold. Um, maybe we'll have to show you some of the other interior layouts. Yeah, the other ones are pretty sick. So I haven't seen this interior layout. Let's go in here. Look at this. We got the bed right here. And we've got... Oh, dude, it's all good. That's what it sounds like if you're living in this thing. Exactly. And you have to blow your nose. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> we have the Garmin here. That's really neat how that's all integrated. I like this. Look at the circular sink there. This one looks a lot different than the last. Triple burner, it looks like. Uh, a little more sophisticated interior kitchen furion um this could be a microwave air fryer everything i got too with the oven look at that big old fridge and freezer a little bit smaller dinette um but perfect for two like plenty big for two uh, i don't know though. the table kind of hits i love the dinette and the other one a lot better um look at all that that's amazing Wow, look at that, you get your Cheez-Its in here, your spices, whatever you want. I don't even eat Cheez-Its that much, I don't know why I said that. But, um, Sweet bathroom. All right, look at that. So this has got four 570 amp Battleborn batteries in here. And so that'll give you 1,080 amp hours on this guy. And it's all Victron controlled with a 3,000 watt converter. That is rad. And this has got 800, this one here has got 800 watts on the roof. Wow, And nice. that guy over there that you just looked at, that's got 700 watts on the roof. Nice. And then you have another 600 watts that you put out on the ground. Yeah. You got a total of 1,200 watts of solar. That is awesome. All right, let's look at the inside of this one. I like all the different power options. This one's got a really cool uh, little workspace right there with the window. And then uh, kitchen all in here and the bed. Like I like how this is a main bed, but also makes into a really nice little place to seat. Place to sit. You got some bunks, a couple bunks, really big bathroom here. Um, but yeah, you guys, I think overall, so these are dual axles, the last two we looked at. The first one is a single axle. Well, they're not axle, they're IFS, but two wheels. I think overall, that one's my favorite for sure because it's smaller and it feels like it has just as much space. So yeah, this trailer's sweet. How would someone go ahead and, and get in touch with uh, owning one of these? So you guys have seen me on video. My name is Campin' Randy. I work for ROA Off-Road, which is rvsofamerica.com. This is one of our trucks here, but we sell all off-road campers. So we have the Paws by Palomino. We have Imperial Outdoors, uh, Conqueror. We also do Escapod and uh, OBI Dwellers. We have the new BRS Sherpa and Pursuit on the place. Uh, so we're in Greenville, South Carolina. We also have a location in Utah. And follow us on uh, YouTube. Check out our videos where we do one hour walkthroughs through all of our off-road campers. And we're all about support after the post sale. So that's what makes us different than everybody else. And we're campers and we take these out tested. We don't just sell them and push you out the door after you buy them. So it's awesome. I've, I've had an absolute blast at Overland Expo East this year showing everybody campers and getting everybody involved in camping yeah it's been fun uh meeting cool, you yesterday yeah and yesterday. then you were like stop by and we were moseying around and these like genuinely caught my eye and i was like oh yeah Andy. thanks for stopping yeah. by i appreciate it thanks yeah. for talking with me and stuff so it's awesome for sure thanks for showing them thank you guys for watching hit that like if you enjoyed it comment <laughs> peace you're down to mob i think oh yeah right down to mob the only question is are you down to mob <laughs>